Hello, hello, what's up everyone? Today we're gonna talk about sea salt. Sea salt is amazing for dreadlocks. It's a process accelerator because it makes the hair frizzy and knotty. It also makes the hair dry. Therefore, it increases the formation of locks. It is not only perfect for young dreads, but also for loose hair on fully mature dreadlocks, like on the tips, for example. You can get the benefits of sea salt by swimming in the ocean. But if you do not live by the ocean, or if you cannot swim for any other reason, you can still have the same effect by making a sea salt spray. To make a sea salt spray, you will need warm water, sea salt, and the spray bottle. It's better to use pure sea salt with no chemical additives. Add just enough salt to water. Adding too much salt to water may clog your spray tube. Stir very well till the salt dissolves completely. Then pour everything in the spray bottle. If your dreads are young, spray everywhere. But if your dreads are already matured, spray only on loose hair and on the tips. If you are just starting to use sea salt, it's better that you start spraying for short periods of time before showering, because you still don't know your hair reaction to salt. If your hair is of the dry type, avoid sea salt, as it may dry it more, and that would damage it. While spraying, avoid eyes and also avoid the scalp of your hair. Having salt on your scalp might be irritating. Some people add lemon juice and that increases the effect of dryness. But remember, if your hair is dry, do not use sea salt. Or if you use sea salt, there is no need to add more drying things. I hope this video was useful. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Have a good time. Bye.